Oh, my, my name is Ron Simmer. I'm a local uh, Vancouver artist and sculptor, and I try and make uh, interesting art of recycled materials. And this is another example of recycling uh, somebody else's discarded art project. This week we're assembling the Embrace Heart. The Embrace Heart was a, was a project uh, by some Vancouver burners to uh, participate in the Embrace project in, in Burning Man of two years ago. This, this gentleman, Matt, made these uh, two figures, male and female figure, out of wood and they would, of course, burn it. And uh, it was quite an enormous job. It was involved several cities and, and dozens, and, if not hundreds of people, were contributing to this in various ways. The, the city of Portland made a, a glowing heart, and the city of Vancouver made this, this heart here, which actually was in several pieces and mechanically expanded and contracted as a heart beat. Very difficult uh, thing to do mechanically, but they actually did it. The heart came back to Vancouver, and the, the people, Deb Boudreau and other people who had made it, were trying to recycle the heart to find a new life for it in Vancouver. They tried to give it to the city of Vancouver to put it in the, one of the uh, community centers. That didn't work out for various reasons. So they, they got very depressed and unhappy with this and they, they gave it to me to, to recycle. The heart was a wonderful project. I, I like it very much. It's really got a lot of character, I think. And uh, it was a terrible shame to throw it away, I thought. What I do is recycle uh, materials wherever I can find them. And this is another example of recycling an old, another art piece that was going to be uh, tossed aside in garbage and uh, find a new, new home for it, new, new, a new life for it. One of, the, one of the people who was trying to fix it previously bored a lot of holes in it and they, they were going to stitch it together with wire. So I, I continued that idea and would have put a lot of uh, aircraft wire into it. So on the other side there's a, a stitching. So it kind of looks like a, a, perhaps a broken heart. Everybody's had a, their heart broken at some time in their life, I guess, over some relationship that didn't work out. So it's, uh, it's, I guess it uh, resonates with people with broken hearts. There you go. Lexan is a very tough plastic, so I drilled uh, hundred, hundreds of holes in Lexan and bolted the Lexan into, into the heart to, uh, to pull the pieces together. Yeah, the, it won't just be a static piece of uh, piece of sculpture, it's going to be a live beating heart. A friend of mine, Liam Summers, an electrical engineer, he, he uh, put together an Arduino and some LEDs and we're going to uh, sim do simulated heartbeat. One of the, the, the actual ideas was to have a sensor on the heart so that we pick up a person's heartbeat. A person could put his hand on, on the heart and the sensor would pick up that person's heartbeat and replicate it, amplify it and replicate it and uh, show it as, as the flashing lights. We tried that but our sensor didn't work terribly well so we had to work on a better medical grade sensor I guess. So for now the default is just a, a, a standard sort of slow 60 pulses a minute heartbeat. We tested the system and it works and uh, we have the LEDs and the Arduino and uh, all, all the wiring and computer technology to do that and it's gonna it does work and we just have to install it and tweak it. It was broken and now it's fixed. There you go. We've been in a broken heart. I, I saw this art call from Arts Alive in, in uh, Oak Bay, Victoria. That I submitted to them and they liked the idea and uh, it'll be part of a year-long exhibition. So there's there's, a, there's all, all kinds of ongoing sculpture exhibitions on a yearly basis rotation all the time and uh, I, it's one way of getting your work out there and participating and, and having fun showing your art. So, the heart might find a new place after the Arts Alive exhibition, maybe it would find a new place outside some hospital. In fact, the, the Children's Hospital just had a big art call for our projects and uh, I'd be delighted if they entertained the idea of having a beating heart. Why not?